This is the rubber match in that battle. And we are underway here. South Dakota won the toss and chose to receive. So it will be the Yotes in all white today, starting with the football first. Mason Lorber now on for a chip shot. 20-yard field goal. Pressure off the edge there. C.J. Siegel nearly got to that football. We saw you in the block of field goal last week. Lorber, though, the senior, able to power one home. North Dakota averaging over 200 a game. Here's first and 10 for Schuster, looking deep on play action. He's got Mogg inside the 10-yard line. Garrett Mogg able to get free in the secondary, and North Dakota has a first and goal situation on the way. Victories, and they would go on to the FCS playoffs as a seed is Vaughn on third and three. Puts one in the air, caught, touchdown, North Dakota. Adam Zavalny, the freshman tight end. Play design. Quincy Vaughn comes in. You're thinking, run the ball, run the ball. And he throws a perfect ball right there for a touchdown. That's a great play design. South Dakota had not seen that. That's a brand new wrinkle. And a huge touchdown for North Dakota. Great play coming out there. And a good, good ball by Quincy as well. First career touchdown throw for Vaughn. First career touchdown catch for Zavalny, the redshirt freshman from Park River. Of two. Pressure again coming, and they get home this time. Jalen Johnson in the backfield. Graham DeVore there as well. First sack of the ball game for UND. That's Belquist in motion on second and eight. Schuster to throw. He's going to lob one in. Great catch. Second down now in eight from the 43. Camp. Trying to step up, and he's going to get dropped again. Navratil and Johnson in the backfield. Second sack of the half for this fight against that memory. We'll start with a toss to Otis Weah. And Otis has a huge hole down the sideline. Weah knocked down just shy of the 30. A big gain to open up the third quarter for the Weah on the carry. Another big hole. Otis Weah breaking through and into the end zone for the touchdown. The sophomore tailback from 18 yards out. Third game in a row that North Dakota opens up the second half with a score. Good vision by Otis, too, to decide to cut back with that and go the opposite direction. Breaks the first tackle, breaks the second, charges his way in for the touch. You can see right there, he's good vision. Hey, I got to cut back on this. I got a blocker on the outside. And then Otis does the rest for the touchdown. He did the heavy lifting on this drive, that 45-yard carry. On the first play of the drive as Adam Stage is extra pointed. Pressure again, and Camp is going to get dropped inside the 20. Turner back to back sacks for the senior captain. He had the big strip sack a week ago on South Dakota State freshman quarterback Mark Gronowski. Two plays in a row, he takes down the Yote freshman QB. Jackson Turner's really hard to block, especially in a one-on-one -on -one situation like that. You've got to have a running back chip or help out, especially with the... Hard to find. Third down in shorts. Weah again able to spin away through first contact, and he's loose again. Weah inside the 30, and finally knocked out right at the 25-yard line. Weah on the carry. In there for the score! Weya and this Fighting Hawks offense coming to life here in the third quarter once again. Well, if you're ever in doubt, give it to 26. I mean, he's just able to do unbelievable things. Great play here. Gets a great block. Jumps in the end zone. Another touchdown for Otis Weya. That whole drive, that offensive line did an absolutely terrific job getting out in space, getting on blockers, doing everything they needed to do to make that a successful possession for the Fighting Hawks. Stage on for the extra points. And it is up and through. Schweigert looks on. Henry another run up the middle. Stretching, and he's in for the touchdown. Kai Henry from seven yards out. First touchdown of the day for the Cubs. Through the air, another third down opportunity for UND. 75% on third down today. Schuster wide open, Derek Paulson. The drive remains alive. First grab of the evening for the senior. Right now, here North Dakota's defense, I think you stick with what you do and you bring that pressure. Yotes 0 for 1 on fourth down today. They're going up top. 
Kennedy's there and he's got the pick. Jordan Kennedy, the senior safety. His second interception in his men. Talented football team. You're exactly right. They're a team that nobody's going to want to see in the conference. USD gets Missouri State at home on March the 13th, the 1 p.m. game. North Dakota, they'll hit the road for the first time next week. They got about 10 days to get ready for that one, a trip to Macomb to take on Western Illinois. They will savor this one, though, a 21-10 victory over number